Greetings. Thanks for tuning in and listening to Channel Peace if you can find it. At the end of the video, if you like it, please share that with the icon, the thumbs up. Uh, share and leave a comment. But I want you to listen to this before I give my thoughts on it. Listen. It's from the uh, Erie County prison spent the day cleaning up trees down in a recent storm. The work launches the pilot of a new community works program. The initiative aims to support public projects with no cost labor. Did you hear that? Yeah. And slavery is alive and well in 2024 America. And it stems in the prison system now and outside of that too, in the uh, agricultural system, a lot of slavery is going on full bloom and no one is talking about it. No one is, cares because we're looking at the clowns keeping us entertained. But the prisoners, and many are in there to no fault of their own and they ended up in the cotton fields picking cotton doing deplorable things it's a prison out west where the warden makes the men wear pink so they could do you any kind of way even uh visitors that come they could strip you and it was like a test and he wanted this this white guard wanted this black man to bend over and cough and he was just a a lawyer they could do anything to you and so much is happening to them in there and no one talks about it. No one talks about these young boys that are in there being brutally violated. And they're in there for no fault of their own. And no one is talking about these um, policemen that have these extensive disciplinary records. No one went back to check all their arrests because there's so many and they're just suffering. They man got to be gone. That's an entirely different world. It's a city of its own. This is what I'm hearing. In these prisons. And now they're slaves. You see them on the freeways. Um, and I look to see their faces and I look to see if they black or white. And for the most part, they black. And they're cleaning up suburban highways nothing has changed but those who are serious about voting and, and get so giggly about being black for Trump but are you questioning them what they gonna do about your uncle your brother your distant cousin somebody you know a neighbor that's locked up for no reason of their own. And, and I never forget Khalif Browder. He came out and self-eliminated himself. Couldn't handle the pressure with what happened to him being locked up for three years to no fault of his own. And then his mother followed him. It was too much of a despair for her heart. But yeah, slavery is going on right now. It's alive and well. Nothing has changed. And they coming out verbally with their insults to us. And we take it, we laugh, and, and no one speaks up for us. Not even our own. But they can say and do anything to us. And blatantly, we don't even know what's going on. Didn't um, the, the poachers go to Morehouse College? It's like... And he was browbeating them but not offering them any solutions. So before I end, what is the solution we're gonna ask for these politicians to give us for their vote? Give me a reason why I should vote when it's both wings fly the same one bird. What are we asking them for? What about our prisoners that need to who uh, records need to be reviewed. What about that? That's a start. Huh? What are you asking for for your vote? Besides a red hat. 
And surely you want the opposite of what's going on now, but there's a lot of us are gung ho for this. I can't imagine where did these people come from that are going along with what has been going on for the last three to four years. How can you go along with this? So, peace if you can find it. Thanks for tuning in and listening. Like and share. Leave a comment. Subscribe. Uh, thunder back at me uh, what you feel about this. I'm too hostile and bitter and negative and cynical and, and, and see that the light at the end of the tunnel is a fast moving train. I want to talk about some real shit. I don't know about Puff Daddy or this trial that's been going on forever. So let's talk about solutions. They said, talk about solutions. Let's talk about solutions. Peace if you can find it. Thanks for tuning in and listening.